Matthew Ladd here with Group Kenworth Montreal TNT Trucks and Tips. This week we're going to take a look at inverters. First off, what does an inverter do? It takes DC power or direct current power from the batteries and converts it into AC, alternating current, or household power. This allows the driver to plug in a microwave, a laptop, or whatever else he needs to plug in to a household plug and run that instead of running the truck at nighttime, causing more idle time, which leads to greater issues. Today, we're going to take a look at an Eaton 1800 watt factory installed inverter. Let's go take a look. Now, where is the inverter located? It is underneath the sleeper bunk. So you reach under here. Now, once the bed is lifted up in the air, if you look down here at the back, this is an 1800 watt factory installed inverter. On the side of the inverter is a reset if you were ever to overload it. Now we're looking at the controls in the sleeper behind the driver's seat. Here is the inverter controls, in this case a factory installed Eaton inverter, and you simply press there to turn it on. What's great about factory installed inverters is it already comes with two plugs, one located here next to the TV mount, and a secondary plug located here in the microwave storage space. So that's the 1800 watt Eaton inverter. I always recommend installing from factory as it already works with all the truck components and talks to the truck directly. If you need a larger inverter, you can also get one installed locally. When choosing an inverter, it's important to look at the products you want to plug in to make sure that you don't overload it. Now all products will list the number of watts that the product pulls, it's generally recommended to add 20% to that total to do your calculations. And that's Group Ken North Montreal TNT Trucks and Tips, and I'm Matthew Ladd. Thank you.